Hey everybody, it's Plutoed, and welcome back to Metroid Dread. Let's see what's in front of us. Although I feel like this is actually the end, so I, f I guess whatever I'm missing, I, uh, I might not do that yet and just check a little bit more for hidden secrets in this area. Okay, so let's do this. Oh boy. Itorash. It, rash. Travel to Itorash? Let's do it. I'm still extremely concerned about missing things. I'm still extremely concerned about missing things. Also, oh, this is a symmetrical room with nothing at the top, apparently. Also, there's stuff in the bottom that can't last through. This is the main control stuff that we've seen in cutscenes, I believe. A save. Yep, save progress. Am I supposed to be breaking this, or what am I doing? Oh, I guess maybe it wants me to power bomb. Yes. Cool. I don't know what that did. Oh, maybe. Hang on, I have to check that this door is still closed. Yes, it is. Okay. Use the elevator? Yes, please. It appears your Metroid DNA has caused you to become a Metroid. Ordinarily, this would have happened immediately after the DNA transplant. Your Fofa genes must have slowed down the process. They were the only tribe capable of controlling the Metroids. Though you possess their DNA, you are not a Fofa. Your physical prowess suggests that you must also possess Machin DNA. Whoa. Metroids are programmed to identify Machin as enemies. This suggests one thing to me. It is very probable that your metamorphosis occurred as a result of Raven Beak's attack. His presence awakened the Metroid's killer instinct. Since then, your metamorphosis has accelerated. It can no longer be controlled. You are now a Metroid, Samus Aran. Your very existence poses a grave threat to the galaxy. However, there is no need to fear. You can still contribute to galactic peace. You need only use your new powers correctly. You have followed my instructions faithfully so far. Continue to do so. It's that simple. I consider your performance here on ZDR highly satisfactory, as I hope. It has even awakened your Metroid powers. I was right to let you live during our first encounter. That one glimpse you showed told me everything. Submit and offer up your power. My plan is the only way to bring order to the galaxy. Fulfill your destiny, Samus. This is an order. Disobedience will not be tolerated. You disappoint me. My daughter.
Okay, so we have to fight Ravenbeak now, and I'm, I'm gonna die probably at this rate. Oh, hello. Let me just dodge you a little bit. He has a shield around him, but I think we're still doing damage to him, so I need to keep doing damage to him if I can, please. Oh my gosh. Oh, what are you doing? Ow. Oh, that's actually something I can reflect back at you. I have taken so much damage by this point in time. Also, this thing is annoying, and it can't be destroyed, I don't think, unless I use a power bomb, maybe. Oh, but that's not gonna happen anytime soon, is it? Ah, get me out. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Ah! Oh my goodness, I'm down less than half health. Half health. Oh my goodness, less than half health, down to a quarter. Oh my goodness. Shine Spark, okay, that just does damage to me. Oh my goodness. What are you doing? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, gold phase. You need to be careful. Gold face is annoying though. From what I know. Come at you. Yes. Yes. Good, 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 good. Only way to do damage in gold face, I believe, is to deflect his shot back at him. And just keep doing this a whole bunch. Okay. Next phase. Wing phase. Okay, he can fly now, so we need to be very careful and try to use missiles on him as best I can. Let him do his own thing, crash into things. But this phase is annoying because we actually need to dodge in a circle around him. Ow. If I could use power bombs, that'd be nice. But it's gonna have to charge first before I can even use it. So much stuff on the screen right now. Oh, I'll dodge. Power bomb, maybe. Oh my goodness. Just dodge. Just dodge. Maybe hold down the rocket button so I can get that ready. Dodge. Oh, laser beams. Those are fast. To activate. Just dodge. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh, bad. Running out of health. Come on. Bad. Oh, bad. Oh, bad. Oh, bad. Oh, bad. No, bad. Bad, 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 bad. Oh, bad. Ah. Oh. Ah. Just dodge. Oh, please. No, 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 Last hundred health. Oh my gosh. No! I was doing so well too. <laughs> well, now that I've had some experience fighting that boss, I can probably do a lot better. Which is difficult to say because I'm gonna. It's a. It's a difficult thing, so. Oh, but also. I'm shaky now, so that's not gonna help. Okay, let's go. Take two. He has a lot of the same moves that we have as well, so... Ow. Except for that one. That one's a new one. That we don't have ourselves. Ow. I tried to repel it and it didn't work. Oh, duck. Okay. This is good. Oh, I need to actually shoot there. That's fine. Ow. Ow. Okay. I can repel your attack. Oh, 
Okay. Absolutely incredible. Okay, now I need to actually have him do an attack that I can counter. Can I please not be in there? Okay, okay, ow. Ow, ow, ow. Can I not be in inside the same area as you? Come at you. Okay, good. Repel, and we should be up to the wing phase, which is technically the actual second phase. Gold phase is just uh, its own thing in part of phase one. It's phase one and a half, basically. Or half of one. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh my goodness, laser beams. At least I'm not as low health as I was last time. But I'm still getting hit by him a lot. So I need to duck down possibly when he's doing that. To try and survive longer. I'm, less, I'm more than half health this time. His pattern is different from last time. Though, ow. Laser beam. Just gonna dodge that. Dodge that. Dodge that. Dodge everything. Come on. Lasers. He's firing his laser. Ah! It's fine. It's so fine. Just dodge. Ow. Good. Dodge. Good dodge. Ow, that was not helpful. Ah, laser! Please, why? He doesn't have any time for reaction. You have to just be ready for it. Just keep, ah, uh, moving. When he's... aiming... his... thing. Even if it's just... gonna be... dodging stuff. Nice dodge. Just need to keep this up. Good. Phase three. Oh, shine spark. Oh my goodness. I don't know if I can do anything about that. I have to just dodge his attacks, as well as the attacks from that thing up there. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, I needed to repel that. It's a lot like phase one again. This one. This phase. Third phase. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. No, no. Ah. We were doing so well. If I had done that repel, the counter strike, I think I would have done it. I think I would have done it. It's so sad. This is with all the upgrades I could possibly find. And I'm still struggling. Oh my goodness, imagine not getting all the extra energy tanks and trying to fight this boss. That's probably what a lot of people experience with this fight, so... Just end it. It's fine. <sighs> okay, let's try using missiles this time. The, the regular beam is good, but it's not that good. It's not as good as the super missiles ice power. Because our missiles are super missiles, so I should really keep that in mind. Okay, it's gone, and I get a little bit of health. So you can destroy it, and it'll be good for you. Especially because you don't get hit, so... I need to use the flash shift as much as possible. 
Good amount of damage, good. Okay. Third phase. Madness begins. Ow. Can I target that? Oh, I don't know if I can target that. What? I didn't see that happening. I forgot about that. Also that. Oh my goodness, he's destroying me right now. Wow. The third phase is tough. The third phase is, phase is very tough. This is a really difficult boss fight, and I have a lot of the upgrade, up, the optional item things. Wow. Nice, nice, nice. I've not made it to this part of the fight with this much health so far. Missiles are just the way to go. Ow. It's difficult to dodge two things at the same time, but I might just have to try and dodge him the most, maybe. Got it! Oh, I should be using missiles when it's in this mode. I just realized I could do that. Oh my goodness, what have I been doing wrong this whole time? Ow. Good. Oh, come on, I timed that. That's also good. Him giving me that orb is actually really great for me because it's giving me more health back when I need it the most. Good. Did you truly believe you could defeat me? You overstate yourself. You no longer serve any purpose. Even your Metro DNA is no longer necessary. Do you want to know why? It is because I can now clone an army of the most powerful Metro of all. Samus Aran. No one can stand in my way, not even you. Foolish daughter, leave the galaxy to me, close your eyes, and rest. Power is everything.
Okay, we have two minutes to escape before the planet explodes. So let's go and go fast. Also, I think I'm going the wrong way, but that's okay. Because I'm... I can't... Where am I going? Where am I going? Up here, okay. I was trying to go up here and I couldn't find the exit. It's fine, just go. Go. Go, go, go. Oh my goodness, go. Three minutes to get out of this. Just go. Please jump. Please jump. I'm panicking. This is not good for me. Also, we're back on this part, part, part of the world, so hopefully there's no secrets here to get in the very end that I need to worry about. Just need to get to my ship. Also, we can destroy any block. Oh, please, get off me. Any block with our beam now, so... Get up. Minute left. Oh, get up there, get up there, get up there, get up there. Oh, I can't go that way. I have to go this, this way. Where am I going? Where am I going? Please lead me. This way. Also, running with the beam going like this is really, really helpful. Considering we need to run. Oh, bad. Four blocks, of course. Go up, up, up. Just keep running. Oh, we're so far away from our ship still. Maybe. Just maybe. Oh, go. Just go. Up, 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 up. I feel like I should have been using... The... What's it called to get up here faster than this? Also, we need to go this way through this door now that we can blow it up with our special beam of supreme power. Okay, a minute left. Okay, go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Here's our ship. So there we go, that is Metroid Dread, except for the last few items, or maybe one item, or I don't know how many there are left in... Well, I guess the planet's exploded now, so I guess they're all gone. <laughs> and now we might have the power of the X-Parasite to go along with our Metroid DNA, maybe? I don't know. They kind of leave it open, which is probably good. But oh my goodness, that is an experience. A very good one. Oh my gosh. Kind of, oh, I'm glad that I went to get all the extra stuff because it helped immensely. Even if it wasn't in that final battle because I was doing fine, I believe, on health. Just having the extra health in the practice rounds basically was helpful, so. Oh my goodness. Also, I had to use the, 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 the extreme powerful beam against the Kraid uh, Ravenbeak monster thing at the end there. When it was coming towards me. Oh my goodness. Well, how about that then? Oh. Time is a scary thing. 
As, you know, when the planet's exploding and all that, you just... It's not usually when you take your time and have a cup of tea or something, but, you know. Ah, <sighs> it's a very normal thing for Metroid games to have an escape sequence. This has been a solid game. I guess it's a Switch game, so of course it is. Oh. It all started with us getting to the basically the bottom of the planet with no, none of our upgrades because of us losing them for some reason. Just with our suit was damaged or something. And then we got them back all slowly. And used the power of the Metroids, the Metroid DNA. To get even stronger than before. We absorbed all the power from Ravenbeak's ship. I'm sure he wasn't happy with that. I was quite happy though, because I got a lot of power. But oh my goodness. Absolute madness. This is a this game this game is incredible. Oh, it's just it's so good. I kind of wonder what would happen if they made the Emmys a little bit different, though, later on in the game. Or something. Like an ex-parasite trying to be a an Emmy or something. Or like a gigantic Emmy. Well, so when I first heard about this game, I was kind of expecting the Emmy to be able to roam everywhere in Chase Year, which would have been interesting. But I can understand why it's not like that. But I guess if they had at least one Emmy that did that kind of thing, where it roams a whole area, and you have to explore the area with it chasing you occasionally, but less often than they do as the normal ones, I guess. Metroid is such a good series. Clear time, 9 hours 37 minutes. See you next mission. Metroid Zero Mission, whoa, that's crazy. That's the a remake of the original thing. Hard mode unlocked? Why? <laughs> Why would there be a harder mode? Also, apparently I got 100% of the items. I guess that means that Whatever I did, I got everything in the last area. I guess maybe the the absorbing all the power and all that is all that. Maybe? I don't know. But anyway. New contact content at locks in the gallery. But that is it for now. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time. Hey everybody, it's Pluton, and welcome back to Metroid Dread. Now that we've 100%ed the game, which we have 100%ed, because the game says 100% items there. The game, I guess, I was right about the only being a few items in the last area. And I guess the upgrades at the, at the very, very end are the only things that aren't counted 
before you beat the game, so. Uh, but anyway, I want to look at the extra data now. I don't want to do hard mode just yet, though. So, let's go to gallery and take a look at what, we, what we've unlocked. Looks like everything so far. Oh, s extra specials? Extra special. Ending rewards? Oh my goodness, why are there six? <laughs> there are six ending rewards. Oh, I guess that's fairly normal. For Metroid to have... Uh, actually, I don't really know, so... Uh, but anyway, let's go to the main stuff. Have... Uh, what's this called? What's it called? Ravenbeak with the f uh, uh, an Emmy. Making it defective by the looks of it. Oh, but he's got the arm blaster. That's cool. Did he? I guess he had an arm blaster when we were fighting him, but it just didn't register with me, I guess. But, like, he's got the arm blaster and Samus has the arm, arm blaster. That's cool. Anyway, let's go to the next one. All of the... The warriors... The guy, the, I can't, the Chosen Warriors fighting against Kraid. This is really cool. Keeping them in the, the tanks, I guess. For experiments, I, or something. What is this? Whoa. Is this some kind of punishment? thing that they do to some of them? Seems pretty bad. Okay, number five. In the Gavoran jungle area. Ooh. <laughs> These enemies look like enemies you don't see, which is interesting. Well, I like the, all this extra background stuff here. Oh, and the X parasite thing. Chozo one. This is really cool. Oh, and the Emmy seeing the the DNA stuff. Star Corporation. Excel Elion. This feels like there's a lot of extra stuff set up here. Can't be the only person feeling like that. And there's a picture of Samus as well. But they're both there, so the... Quiet cloak guy... Maybe he... I guess Raven Meek maybe struck out closer to our arrival. Or something. What is this? Looks like some of them are leaving, some of them are staying? I don't know. I don't know what this means. I don't know if it's meant to mean something or not. Oh, that's cool. That's so cool. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Got a bunch of different characters from different games. Metroids. The whatever they're called. Other enemies. Ah, space pirates. Bosses. Ridley. Mother Brain. Kraid. I don't know what the other one is. But there's also an Emmy there. There's the Quiet Cloak Chozo guy. There's, uh, I don't know what his name is, actually. The guy in the back there. In military clothing. I feel like I should, probably should. That's it's fine. And of course, there's at the very back, um, Ravenbeak. This is quite a story, <laughs> you know. But anyway, that looks like that's everything there. There's also the mission log which shows all the things that we did. Oh, too far. Defeated the elite Chosa soldier in Anubia. That's the last thing we did. Before actually going to the end of the game, I guess. Tutorials. Uh, and then the credits, which I guess we can view again if we really wanted to, but I don't particularly feel like that. Anyway. That's all of that. 
And that is it for now, I guess. Since I don't really need to do anything else, so... I'll see you all later. Oh, that was a cool glitch.